started the recording. Okay. Sorry for the interruption, sir. We need to record the session. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead, Pratap. Sir, um, I'm finding uh, difficulty in uh, identifying the parts of speech. Uh, uh, I have, though I'm able to understand the definitions, uh, sometimes it is becoming difficult to under, uh, identify the parts of speech, adjective, verb, okay. non and the adverb. Uh, this, the, there is some confusion. All right. So, see. Uh, See, parts, of, do you understand the definitions of parts of a speech? Yes, sir. So, for example, uh, I, am, I am trying to understand your difficulty in locating these parts of a speech because uh, if, you, if you understand like what's a noun and what's a pronoun, then it should not be difficult. Yeah, so which is, part which part of his speech is exactly difficult for you verb and adjective sir so, okay so see i can tell you i can tell you a little bit about that uh, verbs are the words which have got tense on it or which talks about the action such words are well yes sir okay and Adjectives are largely uh, the words which describe or which adds more to nouns. So, for example, uh, when we say when we say thick book, okay. Let me give you one example. I found a thick book. Okay, write okay. Down, write down this sentence in your notebook. Yes, sir. I found. I found a thick book. A thick book. Okay. Yeah. So uh, here is what here is how you can look at. And if you do some exercises this way, then it will become easier. For example, uh, when you say, so what are the words in this sentence? First thing is underline all the words. Like I. Yes. Second thing is found. Third is thick. Fourth is book. Okay. Right? Understand? Yes, sir. Yeah. So, what is a book? It's a material, uh, a thing. Right. But in a sentence, uh, which part, which type of uh, word is this? Is this a noun or a not a noun or what type of word is this? Um, it it is a noun, sir. It's it's a noun. Yes. Right? Then uh, look at the word thick book. What is thick telling you? What is the meaning of thick? Yeah, it's describing something about the uh, no, book. Book, which is a noun, right? Yes, yes. So the word that describes the noun is an adjective. Right, sir. Okay. So what is thick? Thick is describing, uh, it, it's an adjective. It, now it's an adjective. Yes, sir. Now, uh, the what tense is there in this sentence present tense or past tense um, past tense sir how do you I, know that i found found is the word which tells you about past tense right yes. so that's the that's the word which is a verb right okay, okay? yeah and what is i i is a pronoun i is a pronoun so this is how you need to do some exercises with several sentences to understand which okay. part of his speech, which word belongs to which parts of his speech. Now, the point is, that what is the advantage of that? The advantage is, once you know about the, the once you are familiar with the words in your sentence, then okay. you uh, then you develop the confidence about that sentence. And when you speak up, then the confidence shows up. That's how you will improve it. Get it? Yes, sir. Yeah. 
anything else um i haven't completed one uh, practice uh, assignment sir about the um, uh, using a, we have to create a file and uh, in that we have to identify the origin and uh, the derived word that i could not uh, i didn't start it but uh, now the site is also not opening today till now the... you see the the point is you can do that yes sir mm -hmm. but i am asking you to do more more exercises on your own okay sir get my point yes sir i am getting when you do more exercises only then this clarity comes to you okay sir yes okay sir i'm try to do that thank you Good. next guys Next, guys. Anybody else? Nobody has any questions, guys. Go ahead, Pooja. Good evening, sir. Am I audible to you? Yes, yes, you are audible. Uh, yeah, uh, I just have a, a slight doubt. Uh, I just want to know how to uh, recognize the synonyms. I'm getting, uh, when I'm solving the questions, I'm unable to get the synonym of the word which is given and which I need to find. So right. is there any trick or some other, other thing to uh, help me out with? Uh, see, there are two things that I can tell you. Uh, first yeah. of all, there is no trick. Okay. Okay. The second part is, uh, you will need to read. Okay. Okay. So the more you read, uh, yeah. the better you become in understanding synonyms and, okay. and antonyms both. Yeah. Okay. So the point is, there is no shortcut to build a vocabulary thing. This is about yeah. vocabulary and uh, when you uh, when you work more with these things, when you read more, then you reach a point where you can get it. Now, the purpose of this question is, of course, to there will be these types of questions in exams, but the main purpose is to make you read these things, okay. and that's the ultimate way of improving. Yeah, improving your strength in uh, this language. Okay, but sir, the the content I read uh, does not contain the words which come in exam or even the graded assignment. Which so it's like the con but, I read the newspaper or I, I I love to read novels actually. I right. love to read mythological novels, but the words are like very uh, the novel is written in very uh, simpler language. Like a we are we are using simple words, simple examples, and it is likely that uh, uh, what you read may not match with uh, the kinds of words we find because uh, for practice or anything else, if we give you exactly the words that we discuss, then what's the point of practice? Yeah, I agree. But uh, still, can you suggest some other other content to like go through or uh, any sort of context to read, which will even enhance more, like uh, with a good level of English? That that that's what I was trying to say. You may not find some words, exact words. It, you basically, we need to look at these things as two different issues. You are talking about exams, right? Yeah. In your exam, you don't find it. I am yeah. talking about improving the language. Okay. So when I'm asking you to read more, this reading may not directly help you with the exams. It will, okay. but in a very indirect way. But what it will eventually do, which is our larger goal, is to help you feel uh, improved through language with rich vocabulary, yeah. rich understanding of uses of terms, uh, synonyms uh, in different contexts, metaphors, and so on. So, uh, for for the purpose of exam, I am saying there is no shortcut. Okay, sir. For the purpose of understanding and improving, I am saying 
it will have a, not not just for you or uh, those who speak english uh, to a great extent but also for those who are struggling with this these are yeah. the methods to go through and it's worth an effort because yeah. end goal that everybody aims at it's worth uh, uh, spending time okay so thank you so much i'll try to even read more content so i'll Please. get two new words thank you so much you you don't have to do too much you don't have to stress yourself too much if you are doing little bit that is half an hour to 45 minutes or a maximum of 1 hour of reading a day yeah that's way more than uh, you will need and and be a little more patient with that it will start showing up uh, before you know yeah actually i have a habit with me and my grandpa uh, having morning coffee and reading a newspaper Great. i read newspaper loudly and he listens to all the news so it's Wonderful. taking uh, almost an hour we spend on the newspaper great so that, i have a habit that's a great thing that you are doing keep doing that thank you so thank you so much sure and and guys everybody else also if you are listening to this uh, everything uh, anything that i am talking to you about is not just specifically to one person uh, these things are going to be useful to everybody uh, please look at that anybody else guys Yes, sir. Good evening, sir. Good evening, Pushpanjali. Yes, sir. Good evening, sir. Uh, one, one by one. Wait, wait for a moment. Who is this? The other person. Every thinking. Uh, okay. Uh, so, Pushpanjali, go ahead. Sir, for English two, we got the assignments on writing and speaking exercises. Right. Yes, sir. So I have completed and submitted, uh, well, but uh, I want to know where we get the feedback of this assignment. Uh, what assignment was that? You will definitely get a grade on that. Uh, that will be. Oh, I, in Porter English 2, uh, this was not mentioned. It is uh, submitted, uh, it was submitted on a uh, link. Okay, okay, and okay. Writing okay. and speaking exercises. I see, I see. Okay. So we, I, I, is this the first of its kind for this batch? Yes, sir. Yes. Sir. Yeah. So we are we are collecting it. We will go through it, and we will be sending you the feedback through the okay. same same process. Okay. Give us yes. give us some more time for that. Okay, sir. Huh? All right. And sir, another uh, question. Sure. Uh, I got a mail uh, from English to uh, conversational practice. Uh, conversational practice yes yeah. uh, yes sir so uh, they said uh, us to fill the form for uh, right right see we are we we know that there are different kinds of people with different proficiency from different parts of the country so we are using those forms to be pe for people suppose uh, you feel you don't uh, you are hesitant or you don't speak with people around you. Uh, so if you want to, we, we have several people on our team. So if you want to speak with somebody, you want to practice conversation, then you send your name, we will include you in that. And then we run all these sessions uh, uh, time to time. We, we run multiple sessions during the week, uh, not just this one. This one where I come and meet and talk to you for some time, but we run several sessions for helping people improve uh, different aspects of uh, language so please enroll in that and then uh, talk to people you can talk about it you can and, and when you when when you talk that helps you uh, helps you practice and improve the language okay yes sir okay so so send your name to that through that link and they will uh, get you into this this whole yes. thing sir oh. one more question sure uh, sir uh, in last week no the second of february we have we have the had a uh, english two sessions tutorial on professional writing and learn the rope okay but uh, after that uh, uh, in my english two calendar there there is no more sessions on uh, tutorial on professional writing or learn the rope 
Is there no session on these topics? No, no, there should be a show here. What's wrong with the calendar? Sir, it was updated in the calendar. I'll check again, sir. Uh, it will be. Later, we are running the sessions, right? Aren't we? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have the sessions for Spanjali. So check your calendar, refresh it. Yes, sir. And Many times I refresh, I check, then uh, I subscribe to this English tool calendar, but uh, no more sessions uh, after 2nd of February. We are running the session. So there is some issue. We will we will check and look at that. It's already, you see, somebody is saying, Nikhil Kumar is saying, it's already updated. So there is something wrong with your system. But if there is anything problematic on our side, we will also check. Okay? Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. But, but the sessions are done. Okay, sir. That's why I'm asking, sir. Sure, 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 sure. Now I need to go to this every thinking. Who is this? Yeah. That's not actually, uh, okay, good evening, sir. Good evening. It's Anuj Chaudhary. What's your name? Anuj, Anuj, A N U J. Anuj Chaudhary. Okay. So, Anuj, can I request yeah. you for this if you can put your name there? Not now. Uh, next time. How can I put my name? Uh, actually, I made this ID long back and I don't know how to change my name now. Sorry? This is my Gmail account and uh, I, I'm not able to change my name. Okay. But it, it just no, makes no, it easier. No, that's not a critical thing. But it makes us easier to identify you. That's all right. Okay. Somebody was okay, trying okay, to... I will try to it. Yes, sir. Uh, he can uh, change uh, it in the Google settings of, of the, his email account. He can change the name. How my account. Name. You can yeah, from my my yeah. It's simple, but that's all right. Don't worry. Okay, I will try to do I, it. Okay. Sure, sure, sure. So I have a question. Like, uh, I missed last two sessions uh, on writing and uh, learn the rope. Mm -hmm. And uh, there was a link of YouTube, but I couldn't find that video. How can I recover? Uh, I need to rewatch it again. I like I I was not in the session. Sure, and, sure, uh, sure. I missed it. Uh, how how can, how can I watch it? We will update that. We we do update, right, Ashwin? Yes, sir. The recording will be updated or uh, uploaded on YouTube. Yes. I, I checked the whole I checked the whole YouTube uh, channel, and I didn't find any video on English sessions. Uh, they only uh, update the link in the calendar as well, so that will be easy for you too. We will we will update that. Okay. Much. Okay. Thank you. And uh, yes. another thing is, uh, uh, yeah, there right. are uh, some uh, uh, some. Uh, um, word meanings uh, that are coming up uh, in grid assignments, and how can uh -huh. I uh, improve my vocabulary to uh, uh, to get uh, full marks in as assignments? Like uh, uh, there is a perseverance. I was not aware about I, this. I I would suggest you not to worry about full marks. Okay, this I have said multiple times, and I will tell you again to everybody. It's my sincere request to all of you that. Uh, particularly those who are working on uh, improving the language, don't worry about marks. You focus on uh, how to improve it. It will, you will, you will reach there. Mil multiple, several people, hundreds of people have done it like you in these sessions, and uh, uh, it will come to you also. Like I, I described to quite length. When one questions to, I think that was Pooja or somebody, Pooja. So you, if you continue reading, like, you remember, did you hear what she was saying? She spends uh, one hour time uh, reading newspaper aloud uh, with somebody. Uh, you don't have to read it aloud. You can read it on your own. You don't need another person. But uh, if you get into these readings, that is one permanent way of improving vocabulary. And uh, if you, you see, you see, we don't we don't want to give you misleading information. You are you are grown up. You are adult. So we we don't want to tell you that memorize ten words every day. And we will check your memory. We will we will we give you a list of two hundred words uh, every day, five words, and then I ask you to memorize. And at the end of the month, I'll check your test. That's not that's no test. Understand that doesn't help you improve your language, but the things that we are suggesting you to do uh, in the videos through these sessions and other sessions, if you do, uh, we we are very confident it has helped others. It will help you as well improving it. The 
The other things that you asked, these are technical details. There might be some glitch somewhere. Somebody is not getting calendar updated. Some you are not getting the link. You will get all those things. Get my point? Yeah, because yeah, yeah. Just because uh, I I've studied from a village and uh, my English is not that good. Uh, even my teachers were not able to speak uh, English, so I went to two ways. Very nice. No, I mean, I as, as far as I can see, you are speaking quite well, and if you continue working on it, it will improve like anybody else's. You can. Yeah, my vocabulary is so weak, sir. Actually, that's all right. It will. So, so I am saying, see, if when somebody, I, I, I don't want to give you these, uh, these, uh, uh, you know, canonical examples when somebody is weak, right? We cannot, uh, we, we, we cannot give too much of food in one day or one month. We have to, we have to do that slowly. So, do, do not look at it that you have a deficiency. You look at it. Look at the point, and and it's never too late. It look at the point that you have a goal or you have a determination to improve it. And we are we are here with you. We have said several things. Uh, we can repeat multiple things on in the lines which are going to help you improve. So so spend time reading and spend time listening. Start with these two things and then do some practices with us. It will definitely uh, you you will see in the month or two you will reach the next level and that will set your motivation to do more. Sir, actually, uh, I I purchased a book for that uh, to read. Do you have any suggestion to buy uh, another book uh, which which will help me uh, uh, in improving my language? See, this is the book I purchased it, a vocabulary of a manager, just to uh, improve my English. Do you have any suggestion which books would I prefer to improve my English? No, no, no. We, we, I, I don't have any specific suggestion. You can read that book also, but you read any book. You can, you can, whatever you like. If you like reading a story book, you like reading some magazines, you like reading political essays, you like reading editorials. You check your interest and read in the area of your interest. I will tell you why yeah. I read in the area okay. of your interest because that will make you read. Okay. Some people do not like some specific area. Okay. okay. Uh, some people do not like certain things. So if you read in the areas that you don't like, then you will not continue with the reading. If you read Actually, in the sir, areas that, uh, that many many books who use jargon and. Uh, uh, so many words that uh, no one uh, that we didn't hear in uh, daily day uh, daily uh, conversation. That's why I was asking for an initiation. Like I said, do not worry about whether you have heard that before or not. Just read it. Give time to yourself. Give a month. Read it and check yourself after a month and then tell me. Okay. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Okay. Anybody else, guys? Hello, sir. Good evening. Yes, go ahead. Yes, sir. Sir, when it comes to writing skills, I have excellent English writing skills. But when it comes to speaking, I like flutter. Like flutter. Can you speak a little louder? I cannot hear you. Hello, sir. Am I audible? Yes, now you are. Go ahead. Yes, sir. Sir, when it comes to writing English, I have very good writing skills. Okay. But uh, when it comes to speak, I usually um, like I forgot words. But to speak next, okay. why okay. so? Like, and how to improve? That is because you would have done things that are required for improving writing, and you are not doing things that are required for improving speaking. Very simple. So then the question is, what is required for improving to speak? The it, it 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 sounds like a cliche, but to improve speaking, the only thing one thing you have to do is to speak. Okay. Yes. And sir. if you have difficulty finding people who can speak with you, who can do, who can talk, to, who can spend time with you, who can spend time speaking English with you, we can help you with that. Okay. Yes, sir. Sure. Yes. Yes, so, so where do where do I find the link uh, 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 for conversation uh, sessions? Like I want to speak with someone, 
uh, to improve yes. my english so where where can i find the link uh, where do to where do i need to submit my details and so yeah where can they find it uh you will find it in the student calendar it's uh, all the sessions are updated on the student calendars so for but i uh, i don't have that thing i i have ah, no, okay. i am nothing in my student calendar no no so for conversation practice student calendar it is not present no okay, conversation okay. practice you have to you write to ashwarya and uh, you you'll have to uh, send a mail to her uh, submitting your details which is like your contact uh, mail id and all she will add you to the group and then you can join the sessions Okay, uh, Ashwarya, can okay. we create a group uh, which is accessible to everybody, or you can just uh, uh, write your email ID here so that they can, some people can send you emails. Sure, sir. I'll drop my mail ID in the chat box. Okay, so take this email ID, guys, from the chat box, from Ashwarya, and she will add you and uh, get you to in the group where you can talk to. We, we we have sessions for that you join you can talk to each other you can talk to us that 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 session runs nicely so to so get help from there got it guys yes sir yeah yeah i got it thank you thank you ma'am Sure. Anybody who is interested in that, and and you want to spend time because see, we commit time on that. So when you when you want to do that, do spare that much time, and then be little patient. It will help you. Good. What else can I can we do for you? So there are roughly 25 people online. Uh, so are you guys mostly, how many are from English 2 guys, English 2 people? Can you tell me a little bit English? So somebody was there from English 2. Uspanjali, are you from English 2? Yes, sir. That's one. I'm from English 2, sir. Arya, English 2. More? I think most of the people are not here. Uh, so, OK. Uh, so other people, those who are. I have not taken English in this term. Devyam, you are in English too? No, sir. I have not taken English in this term. I have completed English 1. You have completed English 1, and you have not taken English 2. Why did you not take English 2? This term, I have taken Python Estates and Map 2. Okay. Next time I will take English too. Yes, you can send your. Uh, who was this? Somebody. Uh, Prathamesh, yes, you can just uh, write an email and then we can take it from there. Hello, sir. Yes, go ahead. I also want to join conversation group. Can I? So write, write to that email. You okay. just write that email. You take that email ID from Ashwarya. That that's in the chat box and write that. And we will definitely uh, spend time with you. We will give you. Uh, no, 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 you don't have to write your email ID right now. Okay. You you don't have to write it. You send an email to that ID to that ID. Okay. And and also guys. Please, you when you are sending email to Ashwarya, please use your official ID to write emails. All right, and then uh, we will we will talk to you. you. We can we can talk to you in a group like this as well. This that is what I was going to uh, to do. Uh, it's it's not possible for me to talk to everybody. Uh, in one day, I mean, I can talk to you or talk to all of you, but in one day, but let me try. Uh, is Avishek Anand here? Avishek? Unmute yourself, Avishek, if you are here. Avi, Avishek Anand. Yes, sir. Yeah, you are here. Okay, great. Uh, tell me a little bit about yourself. Where are you from and which year are you in and all that? Uh, sir, I am from Patna, Bihar. Okay. And uh, I am currently uh, have taken English one. 
This is your English too, right? No, sir, English one. English one. Okay. Have you joined this year? Yes, sir. Have you joined the course this year? Uh, yes, sir. Okay. All right. And what are you doing other than this uh, degree program? Are you enrolled in any other college doing anything else? Uh, no, sir. Not now. Not now. All right. Great. Uh, which language do you speak other than Hindi and English? Some uh, mainly Hindi and uh, some regional language in Patna. What's the name of that regional language? Uh, it's Mathili, mix of Bhojpuri and Hindi. Mathili, Bhojpuri, Hindi. All right. Great. Abhishek Saha. Do you know? Abhishek. Another Abhishek. Yes, sir. No, no, no. Now I'm talking to Abhishek Saha. Are you around? Yes, sir. Yes. Tell us about yourself. Sir, I am currently pursuing English 1 and I am from... That I know. Tell me what we don't know. I am from Kishanganj. You are from Kishanganj and you are in the degree program. What else, are you, what else do you do in Kishanganj? Nothing, sir. Currently pursuing uh, studying. Only sir. degree program. Yes, sir. Okay. And what have you done? Uh, have you gone to high school? Yes, sir. Okay. All right. All right. Aditya, be there. No. Hello. Can you hear me, Aditya? Go ahead. Yeah, am I? Am I audible? Yes, you are very much. Tell me. Good evening, sir. Yeah, good evening. Tell me about yourself. Where are you from and what are you doing? Sir, I'm from Pune, where currently, currently I am in Delhi. Wait, wait, slow, 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 slow. You are okay. from? Purnia. Purnia, Bihar. Okay. Yes. Oh. Go ahead. Uh, I have joined from this January term, sir. And And uh, do you study in any other college? No, sir. Full time, yes. Full time, this thing. Also. All right. Good. Aditya Pratap Singh. Do you around? Aditya Pratap Singh. No. Okay. Arun Varghese. Hello, sir. Yeah, go ahead. Tell me. Uh, I am from Hyderabad. Okay. Uh, I just completed my 12th. You just completed your 12th. All right. Yes, sir. Okay. And what kind of materials do you like to study, to read? Um, I read newspaper. Newspapers? Yes, sir. Hello? Okay. What type of things do you like in the newspaper? Um, sports. Sports. Okay. You play some sport? Do you play some sports? Uh, football. Football. All right. Good. Arun. Arya Sinha. Hello, sir. Hi, go ahead. So, I'm from Samastipur, Bihar. Okay. And besides this, I am also pursuing BA from History Honors. Okay. So, and what kind of things do you like to read? Many things such as history books, newspapers. Okay. Tell us a little more about history. What um, kind of history do you like? Uh, modern history. Modern history. Mostly, uh, sometimes 
foreign uh, other countries history history of other countries of the modern time all right great good so find certain new things about other countries and read read something that will be useful to you bhagesh bharadwaj can you hear me yes sir go ahead yes uh, i am 22 years old and uh, i am from kota rajasthan okay and i have enrolled in this degree as a full time student student okay uh, i like to read newspaper uh, ever since i was a child i am reading newspaper from uh, uh, last time i can remember like from childhood and beside that i like reading story books uh, oh. yes yeah, sir specifically story books because i am interested in it and i get bored if i if there is no story to read and as a hobby i i listen to music a lot like uh, you listen to what music music okay yes, sir. and uh, i play video games for entertainment all right great yeah, that's it very nice good information dbm kumar yes sir My name is Dibyang Kumar. I am from Begusra, Bihar. I am pursuing this degree as full time. I am in term two. All right. And what do you like to read? Dibyang. I like to read a story, self help book. Story and self help book. What kind of stories? Fictional. Most of the stories are fictional. Stories means fictional, right? Yes, sir. So, what type of stories do you like? Like uh, mythological stories or scientific stories? What stories about sports? What kind of stories do you like? Sometimes uh, I read uh, like uh, about uh, sports uh, and uh, sports and life uh, about life history of uh, some person. Life history biographies, you like? Okay. Yes. Okay. Indal Bind. Yes, sir. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Go ahead. This is Indal Bind, sir. I am from Pune, Bihar, Rohini, Bedouin, UP. So wait, wait, wait. Uh, slow, I... slow, 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 slow. Where, where are you from? From Pune, Bihar, Rohini, Bedouin. One more time, please. Pune, Bihar, Rohini, Bedouin, Bedouin, UP. Badohi. Okay. Oh, very nice. Ah, now I can hear you. Go ahead. Yeah. I like to read uh, just like comic book and uh, like other book like Psychology of Money and uh, many more. But I not complete Psychology of Money 100%. And uh, currently I pursue uh, this full time course, uh, IIT Madras. I am not enrolled in any college just like uh, for taking the BTEC or BS. You don't want to study anything else? No, I am just currently doing only one thing: is BS degree from IIT Madras. Right. Oh. Thank you, Indal. Lokesh Tiwari, you around? Lokesh Tiwari, no. Nikhil Kumar. Good evening, sir. I am Nikhil Kumar from Ranchi, Jharkhand, and I am presently a, in my gap year after pursuing senior secondary education, and I presently I am preparing for entrance examinations in various engineering and science institutes. Okay, and what kind of things do you like to read? Sir, I like to read some motivational books like Atomic. habits and the power of your subconscious mind and besides that i like to read some literature from from british and irish authors like preferably uh, this uh, preferably from sherlock holmes uh, sir arthur conan doyle Preferably from Sir Arthur Conan Doyle, like Sherlock Holmes. Okay. 
and Very nice. similar kind of literature but since a year i have not read uh, much literature okay or enough literature all right nikhil now pooja hello sir uh, i am myself pooja uh, i belong to yavatmal maharashtra uh, i i i am in a first year technically of my age i am 19 years old i recently completed my 12th grade in 2022 and in september 2022 i enrolled for the course but uh, at that time i was in another institute and i could not do both studies uh, simultaneously so i dropped that and i shifted myself full time for this course okay. i love to read newspaper uh, books especially mythological books currently i'm going with uh, ravan by author amish so that's there and i love to play sports i'm a state level archer and i even know many languages i speak almost five languages my mother What tongue is it? marathi english i speak Sanskrit was my language till twelve, so I can like basic converse in Sanskrit. Hindi is a official language, so I speak that. Another uh, Telugu is uh, one of the language which I even speak, and Tamil basic Tamil things I can like introduce or do something. So oh. these are the language which I uh, know and I speak. Wow, you speak a lot of languages. Good. Thank you, sir. Thank you. So all much. right. Thanks for giving all the details. Thank you. Pratap. Pratap, are you around? Can you hear us? No. Okay. Pranjali. Yes, sir. I am there, sir. Uh, just. Oh, uh, you're here. Okay. Tell us something about you. Um. Actually, uh, I have uh, enrolled during the September, uh, but I couldn't uh, clear the um, first attempt, so I'm continuing in the January. Batch, and um, I'm working now. Uh, um, uh, so they are. Uh, and from what kind of things do you like to read? Um, uh, some uh, mostly. I'm not a, a very uh, conscious uh, reader, but I do read newspapers and uh, some technical journals related to electronics and uh, communications. Uh, 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 kind of uh, books I just read. I didn't okay. read my, many novels or uh, story books. That's all right. Okay, good. Pranjali. Hello, sir. Am I yes. audible? Yes, you are. Go good ahead. evening, sir. Uh, my name is Pranjali, and I am pursuing this degree full time. Okay. And what do mm -hmm. you like? To read? Oh, sorry, sir. What do you like to read? Uh, actually, sir, I'm not reading any book up to. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, I just. Uh, I mean, uh, I'm. I want to read Atomic Habit. I mean, motivational books. Okay, motivational literature and stuff. Yes, sir. What are the languages that you speak? Uh, actually, I speak uh, Marathi, Hindi, and as uh, English. Okay, you're. Which part of Maharashtra are you from? Uh, Amba Zogai, sir. What's that? Amba. Amba Zogai, near to Latur. Okay, okay. All right, Amba Zogai. Good. <laughs> Thank you, Rathamesh. Sir, I am from Indore, Madhya Pradesh, okay. and I am pursuing this course as well as with my college degree also. Okay. I like uh, reading books. Uh, Of and uh, also biologies of uh, great people's persons, and uh, and that's so. And I like uh, running, exercising, and meditating also. Okay, all right, very nice. Who else is here? Ushpanjali, go ahead now. Yes, sir. Sir, I am from Mujapurpur, Bihar. Okay. I'm What do you like to read? What, sir? 
what do you, what what kind of things do you like to read read uh, currently i am not reading any book uh, but uh, I, when i am in school i am reading some books in library but not uh, any pro, uh, means not like, any specific yes. all right hello <laughs> bhagat dev nagre all right radha Are you around, Radha? Uh, yes, sir. Go ahead. Tell us uh, something. Sir, so I'm like the first batch. Like I just cleared twelfth, and now I'm the first term. So are yes. you able to hear me? Sorry. So are you able to hear me? Cannot hear you. Sir, so are you able to hear me now? Yeah, yeah. Now I can hear you. Okay, uh, go ahead. I am like the in. I'm the term one, not uh, like I just cleared the you know twelfth. Okay. Um, I'm from Bangalore. Okay. I don't like reading anything. You don't like reading anything. Now yeah. then, like, you need to start reading something. Like uh, if I read, I get sleep, so I prefer listening more. Right. Along with listening, listening is important. What kind of things do you listen to? I listen like uh, music or podcast, something like that. Okay, but do read some of the things. Okay. Yeah, some newspaper sometimes. A little bit also, but you read some. Yeah. Nice. Ram Kumar. Hello, sir. Good evening. Ram Kumar, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Can you hear me? I cannot hear you. Hello. Yes, now you can. Yes, sir. Good evening. Go ahead. Uh, my name is Ram Kumar. Uh, I am from Tamil Nadu. Through now, I am from Tamil Nadu. Currently, I am staying in uh, Chennai, Chennai, Tamil Nadu. Okay. Uh, actually, I completed my MSc, uh, MSc in Physics. Right now, I am uh, an freelancer as a voiceover and dubbing artist. Um, I like to read uh, fictional fictional stories like Harry Potter and uh, Percy Jackson and all. Uh, I used to watch a lot of web series like that, sir. Okay. All right. Great. Okay, sir. Thank you. Shashank Mahato. Uh, good evening, sir. Go ahead. Uh, sir, I am from uh, Lucky Sarai Bihar. But since my childhood, I have been living in Nashik, Maharashtra. So okay. I know Hindi, English, and Marathi. Okay. And currently, I am doing B Tech from JNU along with IIT Madras BS degree program. Oh, great! Wonderful. And what do you like to read? Uh, sir, I am not reading currently, but I am thinking of reading some finance-related books. Good. Okay. All right. Read something regularly. Okay. 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 Sir, thank you. you. Can you read Marathi as well? Ah uh, yes, I can speak and read both. Okay. So you do you read anything in Marathi? Uh actually uh, during school time there was subject, so I used to read and write. All right. Very nice. Okay, sir. Very thank good. you. Stuti Sharma. Stuti Sharma. I'm sorry. Stuti Sharma, not here. All right. Uh, Amrit Raj, can you hear me? Yes, sir. I can hear you, sir. Good evening, uh, sir. Good evening. Yes, sir. My name is Amrit Raj, sir. I am from Andhra Pradesh. Good. I am currently pursuing only a BS degree. I have completed my class plus two. Yes, sir. I I read a book. Book of Colin over, sir, along with us, with us, wow. and J.K. Rowling Harry Potter books. Wow, good, yes. Yes. very nice. And uh, Lokesh Tiwari, are you back or you are still not around? Lokesh Tiwari. No. Okay. All right. So, so good, good to hear from you. I have been thinking about this uh, since quite a while. To get to know some of the people who come online. Uh, 
so like like I said in the beginning, we have uh, and we have we have mentioned these things earlier as well. Uh, we have several sessions and uh, we meet with uh, uh, for for English course multiple times online in a week. So uh, and the kinds of things that we do and we have to offer you. Uh, hope they are helping hope and not not just hope we know they will help but uh if you need any specific kind of help do send us an email and we will look in, look into that any anything else anybody wants to say or anybody else has any questions for today no sir yeah, okay great Amrutraj, no questions all right so in that case, uh, and, and there are there are some of the things which we are also planning to discuss in this session, like, uh, uh, but but it helps me in particular if you uh, if you have questions or if you have uh, at least topics that we you are finding difficult to understand from the video, or you would want me to uh, elaborate on something that helps. I'll, I'll do that on priority, but there are a couple of topics that I have been thinking about discussing with you. I'll come back uh, to those topics from the beginning and we'll discuss them as well. Uh, in the meantime, take good care of yourself, do your homework assignments and keep reading. All right, guys. Okay, sir. Yes. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, sir. sir. Thank you, sir. Good evening. Thank you, Take sir. Thank you, sir. Bye. Thank you, sir. Bye. Good evening. Bye. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Terminated. Hello, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay. Hello.